All right, so I'm gonna try to start posting videos a bit more frequently. And around this time of year, it's, you know, Black Friday kind of deals going on. It's Thanksgiving Day now. I bought this yesterday. Um, and, you know, I bought this as a gift for myself, but for not having a significant other. It is a DeWalt screwdriver. Now working in the marine industry, you need something that's pretty weak. Not to use massive impacts, um, which I do have. That's the part number if you want, or the model number. Um, I bought this as a kit. It came with the bare tool, two, two amp hour batteries, and a bag and a charger. Um, now, this thing is pretty neat. It's small. I don't have huge hands, but you know, I can kind of fit it in my hand nice and easy. Something I still wish DeWalt would change would be the push buttons here. You have to hold it, unfortunately. I think they've changed that on their power stack, then they went to a different generation of battery and they kept, kept the old style. I hate it. Um, go through this thing. It's got a clutch on it, so that's set to max right now. You can go all the way down to one and strip it out with your fingers. Um, oh yeah, that's another fair point. We'll go ahead and beef this thing back up. Um, auto load chuck big fan so I'm not going to play with the collar at all and that's locked in now so it's a little brushless deal extreme subcompact series um, suppose it's 1100 RPM 12 volt I was looking for a bigger battery for these, but all I could find was a 3 amp hour, but I also had to buy a Sawzall with it, and I didn't want to do that because that was expensive. So, this is what it sounds like. Um, the good selector here. Not the stupid snap-on ones with the you know, double trigger thing. I hate that. It's got some decently bright lights on the end, so it surrounds your workpiece. Um, let's take this outside. It's got a full battery on it now. I've been playing around with it for a while, but let's play. Let's go outside and uh, test this. I have no real way of holding the camera here, unfortunately. This would be very cutthroat and to the point. I already did this once. I was mighty impressed with this little turd. Going backwards. I took that loose. Now, hopefully, you get a good video out of this. I don't hold out much hope, but uh, where? Okay, now I got to the point it stalls going forward. Now, one thing I do like about this is I can keep on turning it. Um, but, you know, it's a uh, well, good quality little tool here. See? So, I'm going to put that all back together, but uh, this is the DCF601 screwdriver. And just doing that there, and see, did I use any battery? Still full charge. Um, get you one of these. I don't think the price point was too high. I saw it and I figured I'd really like it. And it's a gift of giving time of year now. So I gave, I gifted it to myself. Everyone needs to treat themselves to something special at some point. So uh, this is my special tool. No one's allowed to touch my tool. This is mine now. Puppy update too. That's Boone. He's a big boy now. Clyde over there which uh renamed to rip right buddy and he is the main subject for uh makeup tryouts unfortunately it's ruined a pretty good dog oh it's funny and then chloe the old hag here still racking up the years good dog good dog 
Well, those two are mooches. And uh, she couldn't care less if you gave her a piece of food or not. So She'll beg if it's, if it's something that she really wants or she thinks she needs. But, uh, yeah, that's that then.